Uh, I have no doubt whatever, as I said to the uh, forces, the civil defence forces in Hyde Park this morning, that the behaviour of the British people under this trial gained them conquests in the mind, the spirit, the sympathy of the United States of America, which swept uh, into an ignominious corner all the finest tropes of Goebbels' propaganda. Yeah, yeah. And when, after the enemy wearied of his attack on the capital <coughs> and turned to other parts of the country, it is no extravagance of speech to say that many of us in our hearts felt anxiety lest the weight of attack concentrated upon these smaller organisms would prove more effective than when directed upon London. However, the staunchness and vigour of London was fully matched yeah, yeah. by the splendid behaviour of our ports and cities yeah, yeah. when they... <laughs> when they in turn received the full violence of the enemy's assault. We ask no favours of the enemy. We seek from them no compunction. On the contrary, if tonight the people of London were asked to cast their votes as to whether a convention should be entered into to stop the bombing of all cities, an overwhelming majority would cry, no, we will meet out to the Germans the measure, and more than the measure, they have meted out to us. We will have no truce or parley with you or the grisly gang who work your wicked will. <laughs> you do your worst and we will do our best. 